And uh, it's time for headlines. It's 7.30 here on Morning Live. Thanks so much for being with us. Now, most parties have voted in favour of the Electricity Regulation Amendment Bill, which was tabled before the National Assembly. The bill seeks to create a competitive and sustainable electricity sector that will meet the country's energy needs. Now, it will also provide penalties of up to 5 million rand and 10 years imprisonment for people or entities that steal electricity or damage electricity infrastructure. And those who oppose the bill have argued that it fails to recognize the cost of electricity and instead seeks to privatize electricity generation. Parliament's Powers and Privileges Committee has recommended that EFF MPs Sinao Tambo, Natasha Ntlangwini and Mutusi Muntwedi be slapped with severe penalties. Uh, they include suspension without pay for a month and apologising to the House. Now, the initiator, Penelope Makona Dano, recommended the sanction uh, which the committee has accepted. Dano says that the EFF members are repeat offenders. They were also among the nine MPs who were found guilty of contempt of parliament after they were removed from the chamber during President Cyril Ramaphosa's budget vote speech and the debate in June 2022. Minister in the Presidency, Kumbuzo Nchabeni, says that the country's law enforcement agencies will act against those threatening violence against citizens. She was replying to a question on whether Cabinet had discussed threats of violence by the MK party if it does not appear on the ballot paper for the elections in May. Now, briefing the media on the outcomes of Wednesday's Cabinet meeting, Nchabeni said that government will protect free and fair elections with all it has. And the sense of a uh, main trial will resume today at the High Court in Pretoria. Yesterday, Judge Rata Mokotleng ruled the confession statements allegedly made by the accused Muzi Sibia and Bongani Ntanzi can be admitted as evidence. The National Prosecuting Authority has welcomed the court ruling.